You might already have noticed that demonology rankings are really high compared to what you might be doing in your close to best in slot gear, and there is a simple explanation. If you don't already know, swapping mastery gear is something that has been around for a while, and what it does is that you have a full set with mastery stats and gems and enchants, which will increase your metamorphosis damage, and it will do like 120% instead of 60% on the first pop. It's very easy to execute as long as your guild uses a standout countdown before pulling. If someone pre-pulls and you don't get to swap gear, you're doomed though. Because how it works is that during the 8 seconds countdown, you will have your mastery gear equipped. On the 3 seconds countdown, you will have time to use your Moonwell Chalice Trinket and then use a sequence macro to use Metamorphosis and equip your correct gear set plus pre pot Now you will be in Metamorphosis from the start that does over 100% more damage instead of the standard 50-60%. to You will spike insanely high on the damage which means the faster kills you get the better. Since you can't reforge and gem your normal gear into mastery, you will have to find backup set with the most mastery possible. Some guys have made a nice wow hit filter where you can find the items with the most mastery value in each slot. It's very useful to find out what items you should get out of your bank or aim to buy. Remember every mastery gem counts as it buffs metamorphosis damage by a lot. Remember no other stat than mastery matters, so getting items like strength necks or rings doesn't matter at all. For an example you want to use agility mastery shoulder enchant since it's all about maxing out. Now all you need to do is find a set with the most mastery possible. Make the set in Equip Manager and get your macro ready. I will link the Wowhead gear filter in the description. It's obviously the easiest to do on fights like Ultraction since you will have the blood lost while you burst, but it can be used on any fight where you get the pull countdown. Main issue is of course getting caught in the mastery gear when someone pulls before the countdown. You can always be sure to pop the macro at around 2 seconds so people failing their precast won't get you in combat. Good luck having some fun with this little trick and thanks for watching.